Hello, this is Hexus TV at Computex 2009, and I'm talking to Vincent Lai, who's the AVP of Marketing at MSI. Hi, Vincent. Hi. Okay, Vincent, um, we're just, just going to have a quick overview of MSI as a company. Can you just tell me what's, what's currently happening at MSI that uh, will be of interest to our readers? Okay, I think this year for uh, MSI is also very interesting for MSI ourselves because uh, in this year we introduced some new product lines that we didn't realize we can do that in last year, all right? Okay. So uh, other than the traditional component parts like a motherboard, VGA car, rather than that, a server, server board, rather than that, this year we introduced some more new product lines like IPC, that is, means uh, uh, industrial PC. Uh, also, we introduced some product line called AIO, all in one, okay. all in one PC. So, so what is, first of all, what, what is the industrial PC, the IPC? Uh, industrial PC, very, basically, it means very small, very compact, and made for industrial use. Like when you want to make some post system, you don't want to have a big computer inside. So in that, in that case, you can use our IPC, very small one, very compact one. And, and, and why, why did MSI decide to get into that product area? Basically because the profit is better than motherboard. So that's one, of course, that's one of the reasons we are going to do that. And second thing is that because uh, we see the TAM, the market size is growing, and more and more application on this field is growing. That's one of the reasons why. And why, generally, as a, as a strategy for MSI, why is why has MSI made such a strong move? It's traditionally known for components. Why has it made such a strong move into the notebook space? I think MSI react to uh, what customer wants. So in recent years, we found that components business is dropping 5% a year, 10% a year. So uh, you can see that about 10 years ago, about 100 multiple makers, but right now only four to five multiple makers. And in the future, maybe motherboard will not be very popular, even not a product you can buy in the re retail store, because people get in to buy system more rather than component yeah. DIY. That's okay. one of the reasons why. And do you think um, in terms of the system buying, is, is the trend towards these smaller netbook type of sort of mini devices? Yeah, definitely, because the system, people like small but powerful one, right? Like a cell phone. Usually we have a big one, Motorola big one. Right now we have cell phone provided about 100 times power compared to the original one, right? So in the computer field, same. Smaller, compacter, but more powerful is the trend. So I think one, that's the, uh, the direction we are heading to. Okay. And talking about the direction you're heading to, is there anything you can tell us about what we might expect to see from MSI in the next few months? Okay, uh, other than the component product, everybody very familiar. Actually, YMS has one of the first few company with brand name to go into car PC field. We call it infotainment. Not only information, but only entertainment in the car. So in that case, car entertainment in car on the move, uh, contact with others, I think that's very important, getting more important, especially when Europe and uh, uh, in US, YMS is getting mature. 3.5G communication is easier. Yeah. So on the move, you, trans you uh, transfer information will be much easier than before. So car information is one of the, uh, car infotainment is one of the field we are heading to right now. Okay. The new one. Uh, and is there anything else we need to know about from MSI? Uh, that's so far I can tell you. Oh, okay. okay. All right. Well, thank you. Thank you very much for your time. Thanks. It's very nice to meet thank you. you. That was me talking to the AVP of marketing from MSI uh, at Computex 2009 on Hexus TV.